completely through. As you can see, farther to our west, we've got drier conditions. And those drier conditions get here shortly after midnight. And by dawn, all of the scattered rain will be gone. We're looking at 53 degrees currently, a wind out of the north northeast at around 15 miles per hour. And with winds out of the north northeast, it's starting to pull down some cooler air, chillier air. It's now 47 chilly degrees for our friends in Lapeer, 45 in Sandusky, and 40s will be common across all of southeast Michigan. Down here toward Monroe, also in Adrian, where it's now in the low 50s by dawn. So you may need a jacket to stay warm when you wake up tomorrow morning. Visibility is improved by a bit in those places where the rain might be a little bit heavier. You've got visibility down to around three miles in both Mount Clemens and also in Port Huron. As we get into tomorrow, once that rain is gone, we'll be left with cloudy skies in the morning. But don't worry, it gets brighter as early as noontime and certainly for the afternoon. Look at how these clouds clear away. And with all that sunshine, we'll see temperatures rise to around 60 or more. Now, clouds do come back during the day on Thursday for Cinco de Mayo. Remains dry much of the day, but then by late Thursday and into Friday, we get some more rain that arrives. So overnight tonight, temperatures down to the 40s, down to about 45 here in town. Low and middle 40s in your neighborhood as well. Sunrise on your Wednesday is at 625. Cloudy skies in the morning for the ride to work and taking the kids to school, but then brighter as the day progresses. 56 degrees at noon. It also gets milder as the day moves forward with highs around 60 degrees or just a bit more. A little bit milder with increasing clouds and again a shower late on Thursday, Cinco de Mayo, a high temperature of 64 degrees. Scattered showers on Friday with a high of 59. That's one of the coolest days out of the next seven. Saturday may begin a little bit wet, but look how it gets drier during Mother's Day weekend. And perfect for Mother's Day. After 61 on Saturday, mostly sunny skies, middle and upper 60s on Sunday. And then we're looking at 70s after Mother's Day on Monday and Tuesday. You're